Hey everyone, so I am camped out right now on the beautiful Crooked River in Oregon. I have my Jackery 440 and my solar panel over here. I'm charging up my battery because with that Jackery 440 I can power up my cell phone, charge my camera equipment, I can use my Road Pro oven, um, I can use my mini crock pot, I mean <laughs> I can power up my computer. Um, that thing is just a godsend and no I'm not getting compensated by Jackery. I paid <laughs> cash for my Jackery 440 and my solar panel. See, there it is. Whether you're a boater, a hiker, a hunter, a van lifer, an RVer, you need power. So it's really nice to have power off grid. Anyway, so look at how gorgeous this is. Look at how absolutely beautiful this is. Look at, look at those swallows over there under the edge of that tree. A uh, tree, a uh, rock. <laughs> it's a rock, Tara. And then to the left of that is a little beaver's den. I saw this stick floating this morning from up there and it floated down. I'm like, is that a beaver or is that a stick? And sure enough, it was this sweet, cute little beaver. And he just floated down and then he crawled up onto his den and then went inside. He's so cute. Anyway, just beautiful. As you know, I've been visiting my mother who is terminally ill in Oregon for uh, today makes three weeks I've been up here and I just had to get out in nature and ground with Mother Earth again kind of rejuvenate refuel my my soul and my my feel goods so there's Lola Lola has her own little tent so she can chill out in there on her own little bed with her toys and she was shivering she wanted her jacket off but she doesn't want to be cold so she's just chilling right there this is my road pro 12 volt oven look sorry about all the mess on the table this used to be my painting table anyway in here I have pork tenderloin and potatoes going yum well they were going right now it's cool enough they're actually cooked but I I powered this with my Jackery 440. Amazing, amazing, amazing. I absolutely love it. And uh, so this is my little campsite. Anyway, as I was saying, let me switch this. Oh, I can't switch this around, can I? Not while I'm recording. I don't think this, uh, yeah, I don't see a button that lets me switch it around. So I'll just let you enjoy nature while I talk. <laughs> anyway, so some van lifers want to be all stealth and this and that. I'm not trying to hide what I'm doing from anybody. I'm touring the United States. And yes, I sleep in my van. And I potty in there. Oh, that's why I didn't show you. Let me show you the best thing ever. I don't use my cartridge toilet very often at all. Um, I've never used it for number two, only number one. But I want to show you my bathroom. Because in the middle of the night, you're going to have to go potty. This is my bathroom. It consists of an oil changing funnel, which I use to pee inside this coffee can. Then I spray the funnel down with vinegar and water, it's 50-50, and put it back in that little plastic bag. I have my wipes. And then I just empty this in a public toilet. When I don't feel like doing the whole solar power thing, or maybe the water's too cold, best kept secret, Sophie's secret. These are the most wonderful, all natural, um, like, well, you can see it right there, body washcloths. And they're 12 by 12 inches, and they work great, they smell great, and you know, you can get that five point clean going <laughs> and yes i can actually sit down in here um, i put the cooler right here and i either sit down on the cooler um and it also helps me get up into my bed which is really tall um oh look at those blankets it was like 24 here last night so we were cuddled down 
Anyway, so that's my toilet. This, uh, come over here, I wanna open. This is my bar. <laughs> oh, I have vinegar in there, I have wine, I have my Malibu, some extra butane, and my shaker, which I don't need. I'm gonna pack that up too and send that back to Texas because I have, I like my, my little protein shakes and I like my smoothies and I have maca root and chia seed and all the good stuff that you're supposed to, you know, all the things you're supposed to do for yourself. But I use this bad boy, this Pop Babies blender and look at USB. So I charge it probably once every five or six days and then I make my smoothies in the morning. Mmm. So anyway, oh, and then, of course, you know, the Starbucks coffee press. I was tried doing the whole pour over thing, and it's just too dang watery for me. I like to almost be able to chew my coffee. I want a good, hearty, French roast, strong coffee that wakes me up in the morning. Anyway, I guess I've uh, talked enough, and I can't even flip this around to show you my face. But trust me, it's the face of happiness. And... Man, I don't, I'm going to have to get a stand for my hammock because I keep looking at this tree and this tree. And I really want to string my hammock, but you know the rule. No trace. You don't leave a trace that you were camping. Oh, and look at, speaking of that, look at this. Why would some idiot put their stupid hair thing up here? No trace, assholes. Leave mother nature better than you found it don't leave your junk laying around anyway that's going to, oh excuse my mouth I didn't mean to curse <laughs> that's going in the trash and uh, anyway yeah so I would love to be out here enjoying the sounds of nature and this wonderful weather laying in a hammock right over there but I will not because I don't want to damage trees so I guess on my list I will have to find um, or put a hammock, you know, the, the stand that breaks down that I could put in my attic on top of my little van so that I can enjoy my hammock. I have the hammock and no stand, but I don't want to do any damage, so I'll have to save that for later. Anyway. Thanks so much for watching, you guys. Um, I'm new at this. I know my videos are not all fancy with the damn drone shots and all that crap. It's just a little old me out here doing my thing. So, uh, you know, if you'll forgive my um, rugged, I don't know, if you'll forgive my video skills, if you like it, go ahead and smash that thumbs up button, subscribe, and... Uh, if you believe in what I'm doing, which is enjoying life instead of working like a dog, um, think about becoming a patron. Uh, Patreons, you know, help make this all possible. Again, thank you for watching. God bless, and life is short. Don't forget to spread your wings.